goodness. Woo! Oh, that was scary. Oh, good morning, FOA squad. I'm Anthony, and welcome to our channel, Life with Anthony. I hope you guys are doing well out there. Happy whatever day I get to post this video for you guys. Woo! Man, that was delicious. I love me some Waffle House, boy. That food is so good. And the grits is so good. Ah, not everybody can make some good grits, boy. But anywho, I had to stop and get me some breakfast. I was gonna stop and eat a bowl of Cheerios. And I was like, eh, I want more than Cheerios this morning. So I said, <clears throat> let me stop at this Waffle House. It's been a minute since I've been to Waffle House, boy. And boy, oh boy, do I miss it. Cause that waffle, I don't know what kind of batter they use for their waffles, but it is absolutely delicious, boy. I'm telling you now, I have never eaten a waffle anywhere else that tastes better than Waffle House. But anywho, I'm about to get back on the road here. I've been on the road now for about two hours. I'm expected to be at my next destination around. Well, I don't know now, cause I stopped at this Waffle House and was in here for about 30 minutes. So I probably get to where I'm going about, uh, maybe three o'clock, but that's still good timing though. Oh, I got my brake on, I think. Yep, got my brake on. Trying to take off without my brake being off. Oh, that was so good. Oh, I shouldn't need anything or want anything. I'm gonna say need anything. <clears throat> until I get to this next destination. Oh, wowza, 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 that was so good. I love some Waffle House, boy. Mm -mm -mm. And it's, it doesn't cost that much, neither. All right, let me see which way am I going here. Ooh, the sun, the sun, the sun is out. The sun is, let me see, I got a half a tank of gas, so I ain't ready for no gas yet. I believe I'm going this way. We're gonna go this way anyway. Uh-oh. I ain't going north. I'm going south. I'm going south, Pa. Oh my goodness, that was so filling, but not over filling. Ah, oh, that was that was that was good. Oh my my my. You know, I really don't like roundabouts. I remember when I first started driving around roundabouts, I would get all confused. And then the cars would just keep on moving. So if you didn't know where you were going, you know, you were slowing people up and, ah. Uh, and I still don't like roundabouts. I'm a, I'm a lot better than going around them than I was when I first started you going around roundabouts. Cause you know you have to you gotta make sure you're on the inside or the outside depending on which way you need to get off the roundabout <laughs> i used to be i tell you which one that confused me so much and this is when i started doing roundabouts in in baltimore and towson that guy there in towson roundabout used to confuse me and them cars would be speeding around here not speeding but they knew where they were going and man, I used to be like, oh my Lord. Like I said, I'm a little better with them now though, but whew, I don't care for them too much. All right, I'm back on the highway. Oh, ain't got no marriage there. All right, let's rock and roll. Let's knock these. I think I got about, I wanna say five and a half hours to go. Yeah, something like that, about five and a half. My next stop, I'm gonna be getting some gas. But anywho, let's keep it going. I am on the road, FOAs, and I have no intentions on coming back up this way until May, because in May, I have to pay for my UPS and my PO box again. Now, I probably can pay both of those online, but I like to come up and do my mail run anyway. So May will be the next time I come up here. After May, I think I'll have to come back up. I'll be back up this way in September. Actually, I'll be back up this way in, is it 
September. It's not September. It's um the end of May. Oh, wait a minute. Hold it. Hold it. Snap, snap, snap. I can't come back in May because I leave at the end of May, the 29th, to head up to uh, Ohio. Oh, I don't know how that's going to work. Here, here's my dilemma with taking my trailer. Here's my dilemma with bringing my trailer. Wait a minute. How did I get my trailer? Oh, I know how because I was on... Because I was thinking, okay, let me tell you what my dilemma is first. I don't know. Can you take a travel trailer through? If you're in Baltimore, can you take your travel trailer under the Harbor Tunnel or either the Fort McHenry Tunnel? Because if you can't, I have to find a different route to get from, to get to Ohio. I just... I didn't just think about that. I thought about that before. How am I going to get if I can't go through the tunnel with my trailer? Because you know those tunnels are like really, really narrow. So it's like, can I take? And I can see me now looking out my side mirrors, making sure that my wheels to the trailer is not scraping up against the wall or worrying about. I've never seen a travel trailer of any sort go through there. I've never said. I don't even know if I can go through there with that. Which means I have to figure out how to get to Florida. I mean, Ohio. And if I can't go that way, it means go through a tunnel. That means I won't be able to stop and get my mail Because Adolfo told me to take 75. figure that out but I got plenty of time to figure that out. I was just brainstorming for you guys out of my already brainstorm this situation anyway. But yeah, I don't know. I'm not gonna make two trips. I'm not gonna come up and pay UPS and PO box and, and then go back down and get my trailer and come back up again. So I don't know how that's gonna be. Maybe I'll come back in April instead of May. That way I'll get some distance in between the next time I come back. Because I don't have to pay it in April. I mean May. I, I can pay it a month ahead if I want to continue with my which I'm going to keep my P.O. box. Oh my goodness. I need to find a reasonable solution to the mail. But here's the thing. I have to keep the, the uh, UPS address because that's considered my address. I have to what is going on with this mess? I have to keep that one. But this is the best that I can do. I don't know how else to make this situation better. You know. So, either way, it is what it is. But I definitely can't keep coming back and forth. Back and forth. Well, I don't think it's back and forth a lot. Because had it not been for the wedding, I probably would not have came back up this way until April. Because that's when the, I usually get my taxes done. I don't know. I'm just rambling on, talking to you guys. Keeping myself busy on this drive, you know. But I feel pretty good right now. I didn't when I first woke up. Maybe that, maybe that breakfast gave me some energy or something. All right, let me keep it moving. Let me tell y'all something. I couldn't be no line cook at Waffle House. I'm always impressed with the cooks at Waffle House because they never take orders down. They never write orders down. And them women were just yelling out orders to them. I need this, I mean, two of this, da 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 And I, I said, look, if that was me, I'd be like, I need a slip. I need a slip. You gotta write it down. They been to move me off the line and had me uh, squeegee in the front windows or something because <laughs> I, I wouldn't make it as a cook. <laughs> Be like, gotta write it down. Gotta write it down. I'm telling you. 
I couldn't do it. Couldn't do it. Oh my. Are we at South Carolina already? Because cause here's uh, south of the border. I think once we go over this bridge. Let me see. That seemed like it was mighty quick. Amen. 